A massive fire broke out early Christmas Day morning at a downtown Minneapolis. The fire broke out about 3 a.m., eventually prompting the evacuation of the building at 416 South 10th Street. So far, there have been three injuries to residents of the building, which is primarily used as an overflow shelter for the city's homeless. With the fire having extended to the attic and then through the roof, firefighters had to evacuate the building and to continue the battle to blaze from the outside. Within two hours, it was a four-alarm fire, and as of 8 a.m., the fire had not been extinguished. With more information expected to be released by the fire department, the 146-room Francis Drake Hotel opened as a luxury hotel in 1926, but in recent years, Hennepin County has been using it to provide temporary accommodations for the homeless, including after the tornado that broke out in North Minneapolis in 2011. And with that early morning fire in downtown Minneapolis, it has sparked a major effort to support more than the 200 people who have found themselves with nowhere to stay on Christmas. The fire at the Drake Hotel Apartments burned through the Christmas morning, displacing scores of residents, many of whom were already homeless, with the apartment complex mainly used as the overflow. Requests for donations were made early on Wednesday morning, and there was an overwhelming response. Within hours of the blaze, Metro Transit buses were holding 240 people evacuated from the complex, with Hennepin County Commissioner Angela Connolly among those issuing a call for diapers, socks, and mittens. A few hours later, the huge response meant that no more materials were needed. In total, three residents were injured and several more treated at the scene. I'm Dwayne Etienne reporting for rjbroadcasting.com.